The longer I wait, the higher I jump. And this one's gonna take a while because we need to jump all the way up there. Okay, we can jump about this high, which isn't enough for a win. And then there's also the red tower. Uh, we need one win required just to get in there. And I think that's higher than the original tower, but that one over there is even taller again. Uh, then it turns out there's one hiding in behind that's maybe the tallest of all. But don't you worry, I've got time if you do. You know what, I've got time even if you don't. I pretty much do this around the clock. But we're able to jump up to the next piece so far and up that green looking thing and up this blue one, maybe even the purple at this point. And then the next color, yup, this one might be close, gonna take a few seconds. Saved our jumping power up to 260, which means we can easy jump up that, so we might get pretty close to a win already. We're jumping so high. Okay, this one's still a very big jump. Why is there a button for nuke? Would you like to buy a nuke and kill all? Um, maybe eventually. Okay, 300 jump power isn't enough to make it. I do like how we can uh, buy a lot of extra jump power though, so we're going to be able to take this to absurd extremes. And I guess we're going to need it, because look at the size of these towers. Is 400 jump power enough to make it? It is. And it's enough for the next one. It might be enough for this final one. Is this going to get us our first win? It actually feels uncomfortable to not be able to make it all the way up, because it's a long ways to fall down. 400 and whatever, there we go, plus one win. That means we get to move on to the red tower. Uh, our jumping right now is, is a little bit limited compared to what we were, so it's going to take a minute. Then again, I can buy plus one jump every second, and apparently this is stackable. So now we're getting three every second. Not sure why we're going up by threes, don't really care. Well, we can spend our one win on a new bag. So let's go ahead and open one of those. That's going to give us a pet that's going to help, a common square rabbit. Uh, that gives me plus five that and 0.5, whatever that is. But look how far we can jump. Just on 300, we can go like way up the tower now. Okay, so I'm pretty sure our 515 jumping power can get us to the top of this in just a few jumps for another easy win. And we're going to jump just a little more, way above the top of the tower. Look how big the other ones are though, I can't even see the top. Okay, one more win. Now we're going up by four per second, so we're going to get another egg. <clears throat> this one's a dog. And it looks like we can equip four at a time, so the dog gives us a plus two and times 0.5. I feel like since we're starting to level up so quickly, I might as well just farm a few easy wins here for some extra pets, for some extra power. And we'll just kind of slowly but increasingly escalate things from there until we're jumping right out of the universe. Because for now, each time we land on our win, that buys us an egg, which just increases our stats to give us even more jumping power per second. And if we get four of them, we can craft a gold dog, which looks like a cube of gold. That was fast. I almost went too far along. 588 jumping power gets me all the way up to the gray zone. 600 takes me all the way to the top from there. Two jumps to climb the entire tower. And that gets us one more dog. So we're still getting four jumps per second, but I feel like we can fix that by adding three jumps per second. Wow, I step away for one second. We have 700 jumping power, which takes us just about to the top. This will take us well over the top. Uh, it actually took us past the top of that tower and a little bit up that one. So now I just get to build up enough to jump up the red tower. So 300 jumping power gets us nowhere. What about 800 jumping power? We're going so high already, but not high enough. So let's see how this one's gonna go. 1200 jumping power, is that enough to get us there? Uh, oh, it, it is. Okay, three wins. Which gives me a new type of egg, hopefully something rare, but I'll settle for a common bear with antlers which is plus eight times one. So we're going to go ahead and unequip one of the dogs and equip the bear with antlers. Now we're up to nine per second. Actually, since I do have one win left over, I might as well pop one of these in case I get a basic dog because then I'm pretty sure I can turn it into a gold dog. So if I craft all those into one gold dog, what does that mean for us? Plus 3.75. Don't know if that was actually better or not. It was not. We'll get more uh, proper eggs, but that was not a great choice. Okay, now that I understand how this works, we're going to buy an extra 6 jumps per second. That makes it a lot quicker. We're already up to 1300 jumping power, which might be enough to, yep, finish this. So there's another 3 wins, so let's buy another one of these eggs. For another whatever that is. And then we equip that, and now we're up to uh, even more per second. We've all opened the moon, but I don't really know what to expect here. This might be beyond our capabilities, but then again we did buy some progress. Okay, 1600 jumping power versus this tower. We're clearly going a long ways up, but I don't know how much more there is to go. Well, one jump took us a long ways up and we're even passing moons along the way. Now we're up to 1900. I hope really get, we get really rich out of this. Is 2000, yup, that's enough to get there. It's actually gonna be hard to land on this little thing. 
definitely got to be careful. Plus two. The other one's worth more. Moving back to Earth. I, I want to try Obby Tower, which is really, really tall. I don't think I need wins to open that. So I'm going to buy another level three egg. That means we're going to get an elephant, which is good for 10 and 1, which means we could probably get rid of the bunny. Actually, the golden dog is going to be unequipped. 1,000 jumping power. Where does that get us? Okay, there's stages to this. I knew that. Stage 2, done. Stage 3, also done. Stage 4, also done. Stage 5. Stage 6 at 1,300 power is enough, but I can tell we're running out of juice. Stage 7, we did. Kind of curious what's at the top of this now. Coming up to 1,500, and that's it. Plus 2. I mean, I guess that's okay. We need more jumping power. Okay, we're going to add 10 jumps per second because this isn't quick enough. So now we're getting 27 per second. So it doesn't take long to be able to jump all the way to the top of this tower again. Didn't make it by a great deal, but we made it plus three. And now we're up to an even 30 per second. So that means I could basically just waltz in and jump to the top of this as quick as I can walk up to it. Because even now, by the time we're at the top of the tower, uh, way too much. But since I have to jump one more time anyway, I might as well just wander over to this tower, catch the rebound, and all the way to the top. That gives me 8 wins, so I can actually buy one of these if I want to. They're all rare. The bee has a 1% chance. We get the monkey that's an 11% chance. Plus 40 times 1.5, so we'll take out the weakest link, which I think is going to be the bear deer. By the time I was done sorting out the animals, I definitely have enough to jump to the top of this tower. Uh, the other one's locked because I don't have a single win, but I think we're jumping high enough to land on this one. What's a Robux egg? Godly, 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 godly. I mean... Do you think it's good? We might as well. It'll just give us a little bit of help. We got a red cat in a suit. Plus 3,000 times 8. Okay, they weren't kidding with the whole uh, godly thing. Okay, our jump power just jumped up to about 5,000. So I guess we'll go back to the moon. And we need five wins to go through there. That's easy enough. With the right, our jump is climbing up. By the time we walk over here, pretty sure we're going to hit the top. Another three wins. Back to the moon. Now we can go to lava. That's a very tall tower. They keep getting taller and taller into the distance. I'm not worried about lava tower. Here's 1,000 jump. That's going to take us a good deal of the way up. Uh, I have no idea how much further we have to go. I can see people who don't like heights not loving this game very much. Okay, we're past the top. Okay, that legendary pet and buying progress really seem to help. Just got to land on the target and plus four wins. I feel like by the time I load back in or spawn back in, I already have enough to do it again. So there's another four wins, which gives me 15, which means I can move on. Flower is going to require 50 wins, and then there's a white tower after that. The eggs are getting so expensive, 50 wins, but it's legendary. Okay, I've saved up 5,700 jumping power, which is going to take us probably a long ways up this. By the time we land, 6,200, and we're just going to keep on climbing. 7,000 at this juncture, and we're still good. I think we're getting close to the top. Yep, there's the top, and we're much higher than the other towers, but we still have a long ways to go for those ones. Uh, you can barely see the ground down there, and those are the tops of other very, very tall towers. Plus six wins. We need quicker stuff. Let's go 10 jumps every second. And I've done that three times, so we're now getting almost 100 per second. Then there's a pro egg here I can get for 15 wins. Maybe we should see what these are like. There's lots of epics. Yeah, I can't help myself. Give me something epic. An orca. That's got to be pretty good. Plus 90 times 2, so that's definitely better than an elephant or this thing. Uh, we have 10,000 jumping power, I think, for the first time. I kind of lost count, but this should get me easily to the top of this tower. And way, way, way above it, which is an easy four wins. And once we've accumulated enough wins, we can go back and the flowers when we need next 50 wins. So I'm going to park myself right here at the base of the tower at 3,700 jumping power and come back in just a minute. That was really quick. I was gone for a minute, 22,000 jumping power, which means we're very, very quickly way making our way up to the top of the tower. We're not doing it in one jump, but it's probably a few hundred thousand tall. And that kind of makes me wonder if there's an upper limit to how high you can make your jumping power. But there's another six wins, which is about halfway to what we need. While we're waiting, let's go ahead and buy another plus 10 jump power. And you know what? I wouldn't mind a legendary egg plus the 50 wins we need. So let's buy 100 wins. So these are all legendary. There's even one mythical that we have a 1 in 100 chance of getting. We will settle for a dino, who is plus 500 and times 4. So we're definitely going to replace the elephant. And yeah, now we have the dream team. 
uh, even so we're getting like 200 uh, 200 uh, jump per second so it's time to go explore the flower tower uh, there is also a snow tower next I'm not seeing one beyond that so I don't know if there is one beyond that luckily for us I've walked in here with now 12,000 jumping power so I don't know why they put the little steps at first like obviously anyone here is gonna have big jumping power you know it's just looking at the leaderboard there's someone with way more jumping power than me, but they're going up by like 8 jump per second. I am the only one going up by hundreds, because I'm the only one who spent money on this. I regret nothing. This guy is definitely going to have the strongest legs in the universe by the time we're done. But I think we're actually about to do it. One more jump might actually be the top. And there it goes. How much do we get for this one though? 8 wins? It's not worth it by the time you get up here. So I guess we'll buy 500 wins. Mostly because I want a mythical egg or two. Uh, there's basically four mythicals and a godly with a 1% chance. I wouldn't mind a godly. We'll settle for a mythical. I assume that means, yes, the monkey's definitely gonna go. And in comes what they call the bird, which is really just a pig with wings. Now we're going up by about 500 per second, so maybe I should buy one more of those. We got another bird dog. You know what, we're gonna do one more. I just can't help myself. Okay, we got a weird butterfly anyway. Which is actually better. So I shouldn't complain. Dinosaur's gotta go. He's 504. This thing is 1005. So yeah, our jumping power is going up about 500 per tick. Ooh, this is even better pets for 250 wins. Godly, 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 godly. What's the orange godly thing? Is it better than mine? I have so many questions. We got a bumblebee. That is 3.5 thousand times 8. So that's much better than what I just bought. Oh, without all the wins, that hurts my jumping progress. Well, we can't have that. All right, well, we saved up uh, 62,000 jumps so far. Uh, make that 65,000. There's 66,000, so it's going to go up pretty quick. Ooh, that was good timing. We just made it onto that ledge. We're going to find the top of this tower. The person at the top of the leaderboard right now has 870,000 jump power, which sounds like a lot, but now that I say that out loud, I realize it's we're going to be there before you know it. Just got to find a way to the top of this one. Oh, I think I found the top of the tower. We went way past it. This is all so much easier if you just buy your progress. Like we went way over the tower. You only get 10 wins for completing this? You gotta spend a million wins to get here. That doesn't seem worth it. Let's see if we can peek down the edge without falling. So there's the other towers. Even the next biggest tower is tiny compared to this one. Well, I guess we'll triumph here. I just realized the B we got is actually a 5% chance godly. So that's a really good one. But these ones are all still better. So let's buy a few of these. So we got whatever that one is. Uh, another one of Red Dominus. And a Crimson Dominus. Was that four in total? Uh, so we're going to unequip probably anything that's not a Dominus because I assume they're all much, much better because they're 3,000, 3,000, 3,000. The bee is actually better. Who knew? So these guys are all pretty much the same, so we'll equip some of you. I want to get a special Dominus, though. I mean, we still got Robux or Spare, so we might as well. I want to get, like, a gold Dominus. Okay, we got a white one, so that kind of works against us. It is at the end of the chain, but through all just a one in five chance. All right, so I bought some more of these. I think they just go in twos. Like there's two of the uh, crimsons, two of the reds, two of the diamonds, and two of the gold, plus a white one. Okay, I just opened two more, and I think I've got, yeah, four of the gold ones now. So we can craft golden dominus. So that's going to be an even better one. Gold godly, four and a half thousand times 12. That was definitely worth it. And now we're going up by a lot. Yeah, like 1100, 1500, something like that. So now we're just going to make our way back to the uh, snow tower and wait patiently for a couple minutes. A few short minutes later, we have 1 million and 20,000 jumping power. I just wanted to see if that was enough to jump up this tower in its entirety. I really don't think it's going to be, but I want to see how high it goes. And even that, it's definitely tire taller than those towers over there. It's as tall as the blue tower is. It's definitely a lot of jumping power. We've already added another... 5%. It's taller than the pink tower. It's definitely enough to jump the pink tower in one jump, but not the snow tower. It was almost there. Okay, so the, what about 1,350,000? Is that enough to make the whole jump? He looks so happy as he's flying through the air. Well, there's those towers done. And we cruise past the pink one with some simple momentum. This one's just such a big damn tower. They we're not quite there, but it's right there. Okay, 1.7 million has got to be enough to do this. I just want to jump the biggest tower in one jump. That's all I'm asking for. I have the power to jump over the moon. I want to jump onto this tower. Okay, there goes the pink tower. That means the top of the white tower is still up there somewhere. 2.2 million. Maybe 2 million was the magic number. I'm starting to think this isn't possible because I feel like I'm jumping the same height every time despite my power going up. 
we were very close to the top to be fair, so we're about to leave the tower a long ways behind and jump into oblivion. We're still going up and the towers are down there, but I think it's time we move on, so I'll go find another uh, game to waste my money on. He'll be falling for an eternity anyway.